former President Donald Trump has just posted on his Truth Social account claiming he has received a target letter in the January 6th grand jury investigation being led by special counsel Jack Smith. Now, Trump also claims that the Department of Justice gave him four days to report to the grand jury. Now, at this time, this news is only coming from Trump himself. We have not heard anything from the DOJ or other officials. Let's get to our experts and reporters to discuss all of this. NBC News correspondent Garrett Hake, NBC News Justice and Intelligence correspondent Ken Delanian, who's in Florida, where, by the way, Trump's legal team has a hearing in his other federal case involving the classified documents. Also with us is Danielle Cohen-Higgins, a veteran defense attorney and a Miami-Dade County commissioner. So let's start with Garrett. Garrett, tell us, what more do we know about this post by Donald Trump about being informed that he is a target of the January 6th probe by the special counsel. Well, Anna, this kicks off a familiar pattern here for Donald Trump, where he essentially scoops the justice system, announcing ahead of time in, in the New York case that he was to be indicted, in the documents case that he had been indicted, in this case that he's a target of an investigation in which he believes he will be indicted. The former president posting two lengthy missives on Truth Social this morning, laying out the fact that he says he received this target letter on Sunday night after a weekend spent at a conservative conference in Florida telling him that he has four days to report to the grand jury, which he says, and which I think Ken will support, almost always means an arrest and indictment is coming. He goes on to make a political argument here uh, about why he believes he is being charged. It's really the same political argument he's been making since 2015, 2016, the idea that he is being targeted by a Justice Department that is out to get him because he is the chief political rival of the current president. He even goes on to say that he thinks he'll be tried in D.C. Uh, because he believes that a D.C. jury will do whatever DOJ prosecutors want. So, uh, again, the former president making his legal uh, challenges, of which there are now so many, a central part of his presidential campaign, of his political strategy, arguing, as he's done so for so long, that he's a victim here and that he is all that stands between this weaponized Department of Justice, as he sees it, and his supporters. And Anna, I have to tell you, I was at that conference over the weekend. This is a message that resonates with uh, the base of the Republican Party, the so-called MAGA faithful, upon whom Donald Trump has built his career.